Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's Christine with Gage Girl Training, an online meal planning coaching service. In today's video, we are going to talk about Adele's 100 pound weight loss. So let's get started. So I was recently asked to do a video on Adele's recent weight loss. And as a nutritionist, I wanted to weigh in on my thoughts of how she did it and just, you know, give you guys a big overview of what's going on. So recently people started noticing Adele, who's an amazing British singer, songwriter, gorgeous, gorgeous woman, gorgeous voice. I'm a huge fan. She has been getting leaner and they first started noticing it in October of 2000. 19 at Drake's birthday party through vacations and most recently the Oscars after party with Beyonce and Jay-Z she revealed a very chiseled face a completely different body and everyone wants to know how she did it was it safe was it healthy what do you think so here's the thing she was on a 1000 calorie a day diet drinking a lot of green juices she's working out like crazy and you guys you guys know I'm gonna say that this is not sustainable. I think it's fantastic that she wanted to get to a healthy weight. I think it's wonderful, all those things. But this approach, if she doesn't start reverse dieting or start slowly integrating calories back to raise her metabolic rate, there's going to be significant problems. So she is 31 years old, five foot eight, and she's reported online as being 55 kilos now, which is approximately 121 pounds. So that was a hundred pound weight loss. So she was around, let's say 220 or so. Now that being said, at her current weight, 121, 5 foot 8 at 31 years old, her BMR or her basal metabolic rate is approximately 13, 10 calories. So that means just for her to function, just for her brain, for her body, for her organs to function, she needs 13, 10 calories. And she's taking an amount substantially lower than that. This also does not account for all of the activity calories, which there's lots of photos of her working out in the gym. Again, she is revealing a leaner physique. She's getting, you know, all kinds of praise for it. And this is the problem, you guys. Eating less than your basal metabolic rate is probably one of the worst possible things you can do and this is why. We all know that you need to be in a caloric deficit to support fat loss. However, when you go too low in calories for too long, something's going to happen where your body is going to lower your metabolic rate, your body is going to produce less of the thyroid hormone, and your body is going to slowly lower your energy expenditure because your body is trying to get to a place called energy homeostasis. Now, this is going to be a problem because as Adele's metabolism drops, it's going to be harder for her to sustain this. And as a result of that, she's going to need to slowly increase her metabolism because if you do a crash diet like this, you guys, and then you just binge, <laughs> What's going to happen is you're actually going to gain more fat and it's going to just be a big mess. So here is what I recommend. I recommend that if you have already started a very, very, very low calorie diet similar to this, I recommend you do yourself a favor and do some weekly refeeds. I recommend you start reverse dieting out of that because what's going to happen is when your metabolism is low, your body is not going to part with stored body fat and it's a very big problem. Another problem with this approach to fat loss is you've noticed in her face that she has had a significant drop in like the volume of fat in the skin. And when this happens, your body can actually lose a lot of like the shape and suppleness to your skin. And a lot of people don't realize that when they're losing weight, they don't expect that weight loss effect to cause you to actually look older. As a result, if you're not properly supplementing with connective collagen and things like that, which are going to support the growth of connective tissue when you're losing so much fat, which makes your skin look really young and supple and supplementing and taking good care, you may end up actually looking older as a result of such a rapid fat loss. So guys, I do not recommend this approach. I think it's fantastic that Adele was disciplined enough to reach this goal. I think that there is a much healthier strategic way to get the same results without impeding your health, you guys. So comment below any thoughts, questions, concerns, or any other celebrities, fat loss, weight loss, weight gain that you would love some nutrition expertise commentary on you guys. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.